Oh, come on in, Hannah. Thank Woo. you. Thank Congratulations, you. gorgeous. Thank you so much. Thank oh. you. I, I, I don't know how I'm ever going to get to sleep tonight. <laughs> you shouldn't. This is the I night that... Sleep with this pretty elegant lady it, it by may... my side. A little uncomfortable, perhaps. Maybe it's just put it's a little it's pillowcase on. Yeah. Yeah, how yeah, are I'm you so feeling? Uh, massively shocked yeah. still. Yeah, I don't, I don't really know what to do with myself and I'm just trying to hold it all together. Yeah. yeah. I mean, um, I was talking to Jason, I've spoken with Brett about the magic of Ted Lasso. Yeah. Um, when did you realize you guys had something special? Was it pretty immediate yeah, or did very, it take time? Very early on. Mm -hmm. I mean, that I, I was only sent the pilot mm -hmm. and only Rebecca Welton's sides for that. Okay. And I read it and I got annoyed because I just thought, oh, do you know what? There's no point in me going yeah. in for this because they'll go for some famousy famouser. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I thought, well, I'll go along anyway, but yeah. it just annoys me because I, I really, I really would love this. And I knew, and I knew how much it had got under my skin and how much it was irritating me that I thought I wasn't going to get it. Yeah. That's when you know that something is precious. Mm, I love that. So beautifully said and so true. You talked about the fact that it was your daughter's illness that actually got you to the point where you decided to audition? Yeah, well, no, she had been very ill. I was shooting on Krypton in uh, Belfast for okay. Warner Brothers. Okay. And, um, and I said to my rep, both here and, and in London, I, I can't have that moment where I can't get back to my girl again. Mm. So if it's something at home, then fine. Then this meeting came in and I was like, I, I would love to do that, but I, I can't. I know that the meeting, the, the chemistry read would be in LA and blah, blah, blah. And then I came over here mm -hmm. and I said to Jason, once we'd been kind of hanging for a while, I went, so where, does, where are you going to shoot this? And he went, uh, Richmond. And I went, Ri Richmond. Richmond. Richmond as in like half an hour from my house. Yeah. And, and I thought, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to rugby tackle any woman to the ground who thinks she's having this part over me. It's mine! I, it. mine. Oh my, yeah. I would love to see that rugby tackle. Yeah, I was literally like the eyes when... <laughs> Listen, you are too statuesque and gorgeous. If I, I would have run the other way. You're too tired. I'm like, mm -mm, that's your role, girl. That's your role. You have it. In my life, I was just like, yeah. it's mine. On. Well, it was on, and you won, and you guys are trucking along. How are we celebrating? with this gorgeous girl tonight oh, God. well we're all staying in the same hotel so i would imagine it's going to get just gently alcoholically messy Ooh, i love an alcoholic moment. yes yeah I hope my yeah. buses aren't watching i think my buses are watching <laughs> congratulations <laughs> oh oh this is going in your daughter's room this is going in my daughter's room because you know i'm a single mama and i i hate being away from her and i always say to her i've taught her as a mantra since she was a little girl mm -hmm. what does mummy always do and she always says mummy always comes back mm. And so I'm going to put this in her room. I'm going to put some corks on these bits <laughs> yeah, right, please. because I don't want her to, please. you know, have an eye out. Yeah. But I'm, yeah, I'm going to put it in her room and say, look, I'm never away from you unless wow. it's for a damn good reason. Wow. And to inspire her that even though I'm a single mum, I'm doing both and you can. Mm. And that's exactly what I was going to ask you as a single mother. What would you tell your daughter? I mean, on a, a night like this, with a win like this, about what it means to be a strong woman? I would say do all of it because you can. And... Mm. And, and to women who are at home feeling overwhelmed, mm -hmm. dig deeper, get up, have a shower, get your nicest clothes on and just show up even if you don't feel mm -hmm. like it. Because there's plenty of times I don't feel like it either. Yeah. But yeah. you just get up and do it. Do it anyway. Yeah, well, yeah. You are certainly style. doing it. And speaking of style, yeah, let's get into this look. Tell me who you're wearing and why did we choose it? It's been designed and literally tacked to me. <laughs> by Christian Siriano. And gonna, I, was, I was gonna ask where your waist went because you I didn't bring it to the carpet. <laughs> I'm it. honestly, I couldn't believe that he that he called and said I'd like to, to dress you. And yeah, to have him literally sewing me into it Is half that an hour. How? Yes! No, I'm oh, so you meant that it. literally. I'm literally never getting out of this. Oh my god. But that's God. fine. That's why I, I said I'm gonna sleep like you should. <laughs> if I looked like this. Yes, ah. so thank you for asking because nobody asked and, and and he was just magical. Yeah. Well, you are a vision. Congratulations. So much, go party. Go live Thank it up. Congrats. Much. So happy for you. Thank so you. happy. Thank you very much. <laughs>